Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. If you have not been here before, my name is Erin. Today, we are sporting a no makeup face. I went to the bathroom to go put some makeup on because I wanted to film or vlog today. And then I realized I literally do not wear makeup unless I'm like going out at night, you know what I mean? Or if I'm filming a video. And you know, these videos are supposed to be representative of our everyday lives. So, um, you know what? I'm just, I'm not gonna do it anymore. For these vlogs, for normal everyday vlogs, I'm not gonna put on makeup because it's not realistic. That's not what I do. And honestly, I went in there and I just didn't, like I hate the feeling of makeup on my face. So um, I just decided we're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it anymore. I have started this vlog out on a Saturday. I picked up a little bit. Austin took Junie to the store. They are doing some grocery shopping. I have a couple little decor items that I got off Amazon that I wanna hang on the walls. I got a plant stand that I need to put together and set up on the back porch because we have all of these potted plants just kind of sitting on the table, like the little outdoor dining table out there. Uh, so we need to get those off there and like on a proper stand. So I'm excited to build that. I also got some photo frames that I wanna hang on the wall and kind of make like a family photo. What do you call it? Like a wall collage type thing. You know, when you have like the family photos on the wall and like a, you know what I'm saying. I also ordered a big fat photo album that I need to open up and uh, we can start filling with some photos. And this is a perfect segue into the sponsor of today's video, which is Free prints. So I'm really excited to tell you guys about this company and um, let's go ahead and open up those packages that I got from Amazon and we'll go from there. All right, let's back this up. Okay, let's start with this one. I don't know what this is. Do you ever order something and you just like don't? What is this? Oh, yes. Okay, here's the photo album. And I will link everything in this video down in the description box. This I got off of Amazon. It has this really nice like linen cover. Let's open it up. All right, this is really big, which is good. Let me set up my other little camera so you guys can see this a little better. Okay, so this is really cool because it has vertical slots like for you to put vertical four by six inch photos and horizontal so that's why i got this one they had another version that was um, a little bit skinnier like it wasn't a big giant square but you could only put like horizontal photos in there um which is fine i mean you can like turn your head but i liked this idea so this feels really nice it has lots of room uh, i can't remember exactly how many photos it holds but um, I'll link it down in the description box. And there's a nice little place here for you to put like your own family photo in the top. So I will say this doesn't feel like primo quality. Like it feels kind of thin and um, like the cutting isn't super exact, but for the price on Amazon, this is a really good buy, I think. Obviously I just opened it. I haven't used it very often, but <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Okay, here are these little floating picture frames that I got. These also hold four by six photos and you're supposed to be able to like stick them onto the wall and then you just slide in the photo. So obviously it looks all foggy right now because it's got like a protective film over it, but let's take one of these off and see what happens. So this is just gonna be a little mini photo mosaic little mini photo wall, but I do want to get some bigger, maybe like canvas prints of some photos, but this is just to kind of play around with, to start off. Okay, how do I get this off? What's going on? And let's open this up so I can't remember what it is. Oh, I remember what this is. It's a gold moon wall hanging. I thought this would look really pretty by the front door. That was nice and it didn't come with any plastic either. It came with this little bag and some paper wrapped around it. So I really love when packaging doesn't uh, use any plastic. I think that's really great. Okay, and this last one I'm pretty sure is the plant stand. I'm gonna just go ahead and move this out to the back porch. That way it's there 
uh, for us when we go to do that. All right, now let's talk about free prints. So I have been wanting to get photos printed off my phone for a while now. There's something about just having like a tangible photo album to look through um, that I really enjoy as opposed to just like scrolling through all your old photos. And we've done the whole like print out a big like photo book thing we did after Junie's first year, which was awesome, but it took me so much time to like compile all the photos and like figure out how I wanted them laid out on the page and everything. It was just kind of a headache. Uh, so much so that I didn't really get around to doing that again uh, this year for Christmas. But Free Prints is awesome because it's essentially just a free photo printing app. But with it, you can get up to a thousand free photos printed and delivered to your door a year. You just have to pay the little cost for shipping, but the photos themselves are totally free. And I don't know, you're like, what? Free? How? What? what? explain. Okay, I'm going to explain. So the way this app and this company works is you can get up to 85 free four by six inch photos delivered to you every single month. And you can use my promo code. I'll have it here on the screen, ErinPayne115, where you can get 15 free photos, delivery free, shipping free. You don't even have to pull out your credit card if you want to try out the company. So here, I want to show you the photos that I got. So these are my first free 15 photos. A lot of these you'll probably recognize if you saw my Instagram reel for my, uh, like my days of the, or my, <laughs> my, 2022 year in photos. These are a lot of just like my favorite photos from the year. So got us at the zoo. <laughs> these are Junie with her grandparents. Look at that girl. It is just so nice to have tangible photos that we can put in an album. And seriously, you can get up to 85 every single month. So um, with this photo app, they sell other sizes besides just four by six. So if you want other sizes or you want your photos printed on some other fun things, you know, then you have to start paying and you always have to pay for shipping, but you get up to 85 free four by six inch photos every single month. So if you wanna get your first 15 completely free, use my promo code. You don't even have to pay for shipping. Like seriously, you don't have to put any wallet, any wallet, any <laughs> credit card information or anything, and they will send them to you completely free so you can check out the quality. Um, yeah, and it's super easy to use. And then when you're ready to go back and order some more prints, you um, can do that through the app. They also have a couple other apps you can check out. So they have free prints gifts, free prints photo tiles where you get a free eight by eight photo tile every month. Um, free prints photo books where you get a free little photo book every month. So definitely check out their apps. This one I'm talking about is just their original free prints app. Um, I'm like super stoked about this. So I'm definitely gonna start using my free 85 four by six inch prints because the photo book I got holds four by six inch photos. So let's start to put these in. All right, so we got this one. I have a lot of vertical photos. Now I feel like I should have got a book with all just vertical photos. Oops. Ah, how awesome is this? Oh, I love it. Oh, I love that I have a photo album that I can actually flip through now. That's why I got these because they're four by six. So I thought we could put some of these on the wall um, and we'll see how these look. Junie and Austin just got home, so. <gasps> Hi, Baba. It's only 1020. So. I need this hair. <laughs> Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark your eyes are shining like the stars I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed Now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow and I was down until you saved me until you set me free my eyes were closed 
Now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly I don't need anybody I don't need anybody else No one will ever take me No one will ever take me away from you I promise I will hold on to you I don't know what I'd do Without you Take me high Feels like I can fly Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't hit the guitar. Oh, she's running. Feels like I can fly. Busted. Mm -hmm. Run. Run. Okay, so weekend's over. It is now... Is that, no, it's Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. Yesterday came and went. So Tuesday mornings are the mornings that my dad actually takes Junie and they go down to like a local little hiking trail and they do some hiking. Um, so he has her this morning. And so I wanna finally kind of finish up the couple things that I wanted to do with those pictures. And I wanna build that plant stand. Couple other random little house plant updates. This pothos, I mentioned it a while ago. It was super long and I wanted to propagate it. I wanted to cut it, put some um, some of the cuttings in some water, uh, but <laughs> Junie, I waited too long and this got too long and Junie somehow like grabbed it and pulled it and this thing fell and there was like dirt everywhere. So we finally got some new soil and repotted this. That's why this is kind of looking a little, a little beat up because it was out of um, water for a little while. And, uh, but this is finally cut and uh, not long enough for Junie to grab anymore. And I took some of the cuttings, some of the things that fell off, and I put them in some water. So I have no idea if I'm doing this right, but essentially I just have a couple of mason jars here. Sorry about our dirty windows. I never clean windows. I don't know what it is, but I don't think I've ever washed a window. It's just like not something that's on my to-do list. Um, but I have some mason jars and they're starting to root. I think that's a root, right? That's not a leaf. I think it's a root. Anyways, so we've got a couple going here. So we can have some more pothos. Maybe we can put one up here. I just love having lots of plants and I want some more greenery around. Hung this guy up beside the door and this is actually doubled up. So here, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to just hang it like that, but I thought this was a little long and maybe too close to the ground for Junie to grab. So I doubled it up like this. And I think it actually looks really nice like that. So just a little something to add there. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and make that little photo wall. I think I'm gonna try and make that here. Maybe I'll wait till Junie gets home to actually start building the plant stand because she can like play around outside while I'm building it. There's a couple other things I want to talk about. I can't remember. No, I think that's it. All right, let's try and make this photo wall.
here is what we ended up with. It's a really nice start and I really, really like how this stand ended up. The reason why I went with this one, I almost bought this like really cool hexagonal looking one, but this one has separate kind of stands. So if we want to like move one to the other side of the porch, we can. Um, and they weren't all like connected together. So I really liked that. I will link this down in the description. I highly recommend these. Um, obviously, I don't know how long they're gonna last or how they're gonna hold up because I just built them. They were pretty easy to put together, but I would set aside like at least an hour to do it. Um, and that's not even counting in time if you need to like redo anything. <laughs> but the set came with its own little mallet and like little gloves and even these little like gardening tools <laughs> that were super cute. Um, so it had everything in the box that you uh, need to build it. Now I just gotta teach Junie to not knock them over. She understands don't touch. I mean, obviously she gets mad because she wants to touch it, but she, she understands it. You wanna show them the little tools? <gasps> show the camera the little tools. Yeah. No, don't put it up your nose. Yeah, that probably doesn't feel good. No, no. Oh my goodness. All right, anyways. <laughs> this is <laughs> a great angle just winding down for the day, but I thought it would be a good time to hop on my phone and actually order our 85 prints for the month of February, just so that I don't forget to do it, because I actually already forgot to do it for the month of January, because I used my 15 free prints um, that they sent me, plus you know free shipping and all of that, um, which is, remember what you guys can get if you use my code, I'll put it on the screen again, um, so you don't have to open your wallet. So after those 15 prints, I still had, what, like 70, free prints I could have used for January and I just totally spaced and didn't do it. So I need to get in the habit of ordering my 85 prints every single month so that I can start filling up our book. And what we're gonna do is, because like I said, we had a really nice um, photo book printed for Junie's first like six months of life, five, six, um, basically when she was born in July and then up till almost Christmas and we did them as like Christmas presents. But then after that, there are just so many pictures and I went and tried to make another book and there's like over 600 photos that I wanted to include. So we're just gonna start um, backtracking. I'm gonna go ahead and record my screen so you guys can see how easy this is. Okay, so I had all of my photos housed here in um, my Lightroom app, which is what I used to edit my photos. Um, so I just grabbed the first 85, so kind of where we left off with our last photo book. And I sent those to my camera roll. So I have those here in my recent folder here. So I'm in the free prints app and they make it super easy. I'm just gonna click begin in the top right corner and it's gonna start pulling up all of the different folders in my phone. So if you look up at the top, you can get your photos from your camera roll, Google Photos, Facebook, Instagram, or it has this free prints here. Your past orders, it also has Dropbox. Ooh, it's got lots more. Okay, cool. Yeah, so there's lots of ways you can get some photos. To select a photo, you just tap it. Um, so here, I'm just going to tap all of these photos. There we go, I missed one. Okay, 85 photos selected here at the top, and then I'm just gonna click next. But basically here, it has uh, some different, you can go through each photo and decide how, like the quantity you want um, or the size. So the four by six are the free ones. So I'm just going to scroll through here, but if you want to kind of adjust things, you can. So I'm gonna save that one, and I'm just gonna kind of quickly click through these and make sure they look okay. Okay, there we go. So now I'm just gonna click continue and it has my address saved from last time. So you can also include a personal note. So maybe you're buying these and trying to ship them to a family member or something like that. It says it's just a dollar. So I'm gonna continue without a note cause I'm just sending these to myself. And then it's gonna give you some other deals that they have photo keychains, mug, magnets. They have lots of awesome things that you can print here. So custom photo calendar. So they make it really easy for you to get those free prints and then also add on some other cool things if you're looking to get some other things printed. So I'm just gonna say no thanks. And now it's going to go ahead and upload all of those. So that can take a little bit of time. 
Okay, so this is going to take a hot second, but essentially once it's done uploading, I'm just gonna check out. But yeah, I'm excited to fill our old school little photo book with lots of tangible photos. I love just being able to look through and like flip through and see pictures. So I'm really excited about this. I'm excited to get all of those photos from last year printed and then start like being up to date and then just every single month going and ordering our 85 free prints. Don't forget to use my code. I'll put it here on the screen one last time. If you wanna get 15 free prints plus free shipping for that first order so you don't even have to pull out your wallet um, and give them a try. And then after that, 85 free prints a month, four by six, and uh, you just have to pay a little bit for shipping. That's gonna be about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed coming along with us over these past couple days. And um, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.